Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Again today, I'm gonna show you guys um, how to install blow off valve on an Audi A5. This is pretty much similar procedure for Audi A4 as well. So the easy way to access from underneath of the car, um, just to remove the um, undercover, and that's where the blow off valve is. So I, I found a part um, exact fit just remove and install it um, so this is the part I'm showing um, right now um, this is a straight fit um, pretty good quality um, customer requested to um, install this part um, you need number five um, millimeter allen key um, that's it pretty much the, as a tool um, so here's the blow of valve which I'm showing now It's just um, a little bit in a hard spot. I can't look at the camera properly, but um, so, but I try my best to capture the video to um, upload to YouTube and um, just show on a video that um, this might help someone um, who who can do this um, themselves. So just undo um, two five millimeter Allen key bolt. Just be careful guys um, not to damage any other wiring harnesses around the area. If anything on your way of removing, can you guys please disconnect them? Otherwise um, you may have other troubles. The top bolt is a little bit tight, so I use some uh, I use a spanner, put into the Allen key, and um, get some support and more leverage to help to loosen the bolt. The top bolt is undone. Now I'm doing the um, the bottom bolt. Actually, I forgot to mention there were like um, there were three bolts. Just undoing the, the last bolt. And now I remove the blow of valve, which is called BOV. And just to make sure that O-ring don't fall down. This is the um, genuine blow of valve, comes with the car. A 
if you're using an aftermarket blower valve make sure you always compare the connector with the genuine one um, and make sure that's fitted that's the um, that's the o-ring and where the blow valve uh, fits first i um i tried to fit the blow valve in the the o-ring the seal stick into the housing but um i had no luck then um, i took the o-ring out and fit to blow valve side One important step, make sure the seal is sustained properly. Otherwise, um, the, the valve won't work properly and um, the boost leak, there's a boost leak gonna happen. What I did was I, I put the o-ring um, onto the valve that that phase it was easier so make sure the the seal is staying on, on position Here now I um, I managed to locate the the valve and installing first bolt. It's pretty much everything straightforward. Like um, you don't want to do any modification or anything. Just um, fit it into the location and torque the bolts correctly. Do not over tight them. There may be chance to break the bolt. Well, I don't remember exact torque, but it might be it's a M6 bolt, so it gotta be like six, seven newton meters. Make sure you tie those um, bolts equally. That's all we've done. I'm pretty much finishing the job. So, once finished installing the valve, make sure to tighten the bolts. And um, now I'm locating the wiring harness on a proper way, just fitting the connector. Now I'm going to use a cable tie to secure the the harness properly. Uh, 
and that's all we're pretty much done so um, once I fit that um, double check the not the bolts the allen keys and the cable and connectors fit it and then um, fit the undercard um, and then the pretty much everything done so That's it, that's the sound. Um, so, thank you for watching, guys. So, you can help me with the channel, subscribe and like my videos, and share whenever you can. Um,